Recent study, diamonds rain on these planets as scientists unveil the peculiar nature of some solar system planets. If a journey through the harsh conditions of Neptune's atmosphere is possible, a unique phenomenon of diamond rain might be encountered. According to a new study by an international team of researchers published in Nature, such diamond storms could be relatively common throughout the universe. Carbon could crystallize on giant icy gas planets like Neptune and Uranus due to extremely high temperatures and pressures in the atmosphere, breaking down hydrocarbons like methane and forming solid diamond particles. Based on experiments simulating diamond formation in lab conditions, the temperature and pressure thresholds for this type of diamond formation are lower than previously believed by scientists. This makes diamond rain possible on small gas planets, known as mini-Neptunes, beyond our solar system. These findings may also explain some mysteries related to the magnetic fields of Uranus and Neptune. Physicist Siegfried Glenzer from the National Accelerator Laboratory SLAC stated that this groundbreaking discovery not only deepens our understanding of local icy planets, but also has implications for similar processes in outer planets beyond our solar system. The team behind the new study used the European XFEL, X-ray free electron laser, to observe diamond formation from a hydrocarbon compound in laboratory settings, subjected to immense pressures in a seed-like setup. This formation allowed the team to gain a longer look at the process than previous experiments. While extreme pressure and temperatures are still crucial, they may not be as extreme as previously thought. Unlike Earth, icy planets like Neptune and Uranus lack symmetric magnetic fields, north and south poles. This has been a puzzle until now, suggesting that magnetic fields do not form in the planet's core, and diamonds could help explain that. In recent years, scientists have come closer to understanding how this process works on distant planets and its potential consequences. Perhaps one day, we may conduct actual field research in the challenging atmospheres of Neptune and Uranus to see how this diamond rain forms, presenting an intriguing puzzle to solve, as added by Frost.